Greetings, Grace Rancho. Uh, we miss you guys. Uh, sad that we can't gather again tomorrow, Sunday. But, but as we think about what we're facing, I want to encourage you to pray for three things you may not have thought about. First, we're praying that parents might take the responsibility to raise their kids in the truth more seriously than they've ever taken it before. Uh, we want fathers and, and mothers to teach their children the truth at home, around the dinner, dinner table, uh, in the course of their daily lives. I'm praying that that is taken more seriously now because of the fact that we can't gather. I'm also praying that we, um, during this time of, of separation where we can't be in the same room on Sundays, that we really get creative and proactive about thinking of what life as a church family looks like outside the gathering. We have to really be creative and proactive to love one another. So I'm praying more people than ever before become committed to uh, the people of God more than just showing up on Sunday. And then lastly, I am praying that we would have an acute sense of longing uh, for the gathered church. Uh, we should miss it. We should mourn over not being able to gather. There should be a sense of grief. That's all normal because God has made us to be a, a gathering people, a relational people. And so I am praying that we just mourn this loss, that, that we lament a little bit, but it enhances our hunger to really be together so that when the Lord finally opens the opportunity for us to come back together, it will be a sweet time of fellowship and reunion, and we will appreciate the gathering of the church like we never have before. Would you pray with me for those things? Uh, we miss you. Looking forward to that day that God allows us to come back together. God bless.